Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wokey. Happy April Fool's Day. There is no April Fool's joke for Pokemon Nuzlocke. So, um, by the time you're reading, you're, you're probably, if you're seeing this, chances are the April Fool's videos have come out, but nope. It's just a regular Nuzlocke. So today, we are going to continue on, uh, doing what we do. Going on to the next gym. Uh, of course, if you want to keep on seeing good, if you want to keep on supporting my work of daily Nuzlocke, look at me, like, committing to daily Nuzlocke, even though it literally ruins my bit of April Fool's, you should remember to leave a like. Do all that good stuff. Now, this one might be short. How many rods do you have? I have one rod, sir. And it's really good. Thank you for asking. We don't want you to fall into the sea. You're not allowed in. Okay. Shelter are easy to catch here. Well, okay, then I guess it's time to catch a shelter. Actually, no. No. Alright. I need to remind, remind myself I need to find a horsey at some point. Come on. Okay. So, let me look at the little map here from the Poke Gear. Yeah, if I remember right. Yeah. The Whirl Islands. That's where we're going next. Yeah, pretty sure. Okay. Now I believe there's also a Pokemon we can catch here. So if we run into a new Pokemon, we'll make sure to catch him. And we immediately probably run into a new Pokemon. No, it's not. It's just a... It's just tentacle. Hmm... Jolene is very confused right now. I just realized you're level 23. Jesus Christ, I'm animatic. What? Let me leave. You're literally gonna do no damage to me, dude. Let me leave. Let me leave. Thank you. Useless ass tentacle. Okay, here we go. Here's where the actual thing starts. Uh, do you have anything to say to me? Okay. A bunch of water Pokemon coming up, so... It's time to train our good old girl here. That's basic. You're basic! Get the hell out of here, you damn water. The water swim man, look at this man. Oh, you do not look... Swimmer Simon, you do not look... Um, healthy, is what I'll say. In a nice way. I mean, I literally just ran away from one of you. Absorb. It's not going to do um, a lot of damage just because... Yeah, that's annoying. Can I poison you? You can't poison a poison type. Oh no, that's bad. No, it's not. Never mind. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to bring in the fist. I swear to god, if there's only tentacles in this damn ocean, I'm actually going to just like... switch this up and go back to Nightmare. Because I'm not, I'm not here for doing nothing. I just, I didn't even try and use Pop Pop. I just <laughs> fucking threw some rocks at him. I'm done with you. I don't want to talk to you. I don't want to think about you anymore. Oh man, Fist is gonna get to twenty to twenty nine. You're more like ten to uncool. Bam, got him. That joke has never been made before. I swear to you. Joke original. Pop Pop. Yeah. He's poison type, so he's dead. God, get Vista, you're so strong. 450? For that thing? Oh, I guess because it's a second of. It's only two evolutions, so. Hmm, uncle, I give. Oh, shit! Go, Jolene! Go, 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 go. Yeah! Nice. Congratulations, George Lee evolved into Gloom. Uh, well, let me see now, because... Because maybe we can actually get her final form now. Um, let me see. Well, also, I, but I want to make sure that uh, whatever she learns, it's like... Let me see. She'll be right here. Go to Gen Dose. 
This is not Gen Dose. Here. Here it is. Let's see. Ooh, not a lot of good moves for um, Bol for Blossom, I'll say, because that is what we plan to make um, Gloom is into a Blossom. Mainly because I think it turns into a pure. I can't remember if it turns into a pure grass type, but I personally like Blossom more than I like um, uh, Vileplume. Let me see what moves Gloom learns now. Jesus Christ. You really don't learn anything good until Petal Dance, huh? It's gonna be a long road to there. At level 44 she learns Petal Dance, but let me see, what about Vile Plume? Nope. That's annoying. Hmm. I mean, we don't even have a Sunstone, so it's not like uh, we were even gonna be able to do it right now, but, you know, someday. Oh, we can't even really do it because it requires getting first place in the blood catching competition, and let me tell you, uh, we can't do that because we already failed it, so <laughs> that's unfortunate. Um, that means we would just have to turn them into a, a grass type then. Huh, that sucks. I really wanted, um... Blossom. I like Blossom more than I like Vileplume. But, hey, what can you do? Man, never. Apparently, it, for um, for freaking Vileplume, it requires going all the way to freaking Kanto. So, you know what? Screw it. We're just gonna have a gloom for a very long time. Jolene's gonna be stuck in her awkward teen phase until she can turn into her beautiful butterfly phase. Alright, let's go back here. Good evening. I am your host, your ghost host, and today we'll be entering into the Haunted Mansion. Now you'll see, this room you're entering has no doors. But there's so, there's only one way out, there's always my- Ah, fuck, I forgot the rest of it. It's been so long since I've been to the Haunted Mansion. The Haunted Mansion, which is maybe one of my favorite rides from Disneyland. So much fun. It's a good spooky time. Cut. I'm cutting in the water for some reason. Um, yeah, let's keep going forward. Doom, 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 doo, doo, doo. Uh? No, I'm not going to consider because we have Tentacool. I'm going to consider this null and void as far as Nuzlocking goes. I'm also gonna switch up. I'm actually gonna check to see if this thing knows any water moves. But I'm gonna consider this thing already caught, because we would have had it's similar to Snoot. We didn't catch a knock towel, so. Alright. Oh, I should try using absorb now. See how much damage it does. You can't poison Jolene, she is poison. That girl is poison, it's like the song says. Wow, okay. Jolie needs to work on her sucking. Something that um, takes practice. You know, you can't just be good right off the bat. You're gonna accidentally use your teeth. There's just no way around it. What are we talking about? Kid Fisto, save me from myself. Do it, Kid Fisto. Do it! Acid, that's not gonna do anything. I'm a rock, dude. Rock on. Magnitude 8, pop, pop. And we'll continue on. I can't believe, is this water, is this freaking ocean floor only gonna be filled with tentacle and tentacruel? Because if so, I might actually just switch to night. And actually, you know what? I am switching to Nightmare because Nightmare needs it, needs it for the next gym. All right, let's continue onward. Hey, you, girl, no inner tube for me. I'm hanging on to a sea Pokemon. Well, when I beat them from you, it's going to be very awkward as you're floating in the ocean. Hello! I'm going to see if I can get her number after this. I did just talk a lot of shit, but, you know. I feel it came from a very hypnosis. She's trying to get hard on me. It didn't work. I forget. Staryu, are you actually, um... Are you actually a psychic type? Let's find out. I want to say it's Starmie that's the actual psychic type. 
Also, if this lady has star me, that's gonna be a very big... Actually, no, it's not gonna be a very big problem, because I have Nightmare. Yo! Yeah, that did nothing. You're nothing. You're nothing but weak. Get my face. You gonna use Rapid Spin now? Please. Confusion. You're in the land of confusion. Copyright Nightmare and Genesis the band. The only song I really know from Genesis, by the way. And there goes Cotton. Big fan. Shell Dark! Uh, I'm gonna keep it because all water types are um, special attack and Nightmare has crazy special defense. Yeah, the shelter is fucked. Yeah, look at him. Dumb butt. Look at him. His dumbass stare. It kind of does look like the eye emoji, the way it's like, I am looking. And now he's looking to be dead. Moving on. Ooh, I'm feeling dizzy. Girl. Can I get that number? Aww. Oh, no number. I mean, I did just beat her, so. It's understandable. Man, look at this fucking Jimmy Neutron looking Pokemon. I need you to get out of my life, Tentacool. Doesn't work on Nightmare. You can't confuse Nightmare. He knows exactly what he is. A freaking crazy pervert. So you can't confuse an already sane man. And down he goes. Bye bye, Tentacool. Onward. I wonder what level hit the uh, Hypno. Well, yeah, I wonder what level a Hypno evolves at. <laughs> I wonder what level Jirazi evolves at. Probably in the 30s. Another freaking tentacle? It's like you own the damn ocean. Now, here's the thing. I can't remember if acid actually does a lot of damage or not. The answer is no. It only dealt 9. That's actually more than any of the other moves combined, but... For all intents and purposes, let's just say no. This might actually do a little bit more. Never mind. Again, some Pokemon just feel like they were designed to suck. Because, like, they can't do anything. Is Tentacle really going to make a name for himself by taking down Nightmare? Look at him. Dead. 315. Damn it. Alright, after this guy, we are going to call it. Because I have a lot of videos to record and release today. Swimmer George. Oh, of course. <laughs> of course. Please be level 5. Fucking of course. Tenta, man. Man. Do you remember when the, um... I don't know how many of you were uh, alive for this, but back in the day, the um, original Pokemon anime had a, um... episode in which a tentacle evolved into a tentacruel and took down a businesswoman and, like, attacked the tower and stuff. Um, this is a pretty good episode. I had it on VHS back in the day, so I watched it a whole bunch. But, um, when 9-11 happened, they stopped circulating the episode because they were like, which happened a lot back then, actually, for 9-11 things, like, um, What's It's Nuts? I can't remember the name of it currently. Um, but there was another show that was, a lot of shows, like, um, the spin-off for The X-Files had an episode about 9-11 that aired right before 9-11 happened. And so that, The Lone Gunman. So Lone Gunman ended up having, like, its pilot never shown again for a very long time, at least. Um, they changed, there used to be a poster of Spider-Man, the 2000 movie, where the Twin Towers are behind him, and then they recalled the posters and removed um, the Twin Towers, and replace it with new, uh, with new, um, with new stuff. Um, you can still find some of those original posters out there. They're super expensive now, I think, because they're, like, a collector's item and stuff, but it's crazy to think about. But, yeah, the, the Pokemon episode, that episode was banned for a very long time until, I guess, people realize, like, it's not really an, an allegory. Whoa, Remoraid, I did not expect you. I haven't been using the Hypnosis st Strat in a while, so I'm going to use it on you. Wow, the first Pokemon that gets a uh, actual sizable damage on us is a freaking Remoraid. <laughs> okay. 
Um, so yeah, the that stuff happened. It's crazy to think about. There was also like a brief period of time. The, the, the reason I asked, like, oh, do you remember that? Because it's like, that was basically my childhood, I remember. Um, all that stuff happening. Wow. <laughs> the fucking clapback by Nightmare. Dead. Tentacle. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of that stuff just randomly on my mind for some reason. I don't know. But yeah, that was my main thing. So for the longest time, that episode was not available until finally they were like, it's okay, we can put it back in. The world the world is healed, but I don't know. It, it seems silly to say like, oh, they got rid of this. It's not that they censored it. They were just like, we don't want this right now. And, um, you know, I can, I can understand it for the most part. It was a really weird time, especially after it. It's, um... One of the earliest memories I have of 9-11 at the time was going to school and seeing my teacher watching the news. And it was like the first... You never you ever go to a... Um, I don't know if they do that for a current school, but when I was in elementary school, all teachers were basically like, oh, yeah, that's the teacher. You know, they have their shit together for the most part. They're, but you never see them like... You never see the facade break. You never see them act like a, an actual human being. All they are either mean or smiley but they're not actually showing any emotion such as like tears and stuff but yeah my teacher was crying watching the watching the news and i was like wow this is crazy because when i went in my mom was watching the news and when i went to school the news was still on so i was like what's going on and it wasn't until later when my mom pulled us out of school where she was having i think it was like an not an argument but it was kind of like a my dad was a little bit angry with her because he's like, you should have never brought them to school. And she's like, I didn't know what to do. And he was freaking out because, you know, my father was a, a soldier in the El Salvadorian War. Um, a war that, he, I think it was a civil war. Uh, he eventually escaped it and came to America and stuff, but he knew stuff about war and he knew how... He knew a, de a declaration of war when he saw one, basically. And with that, everyone, that's the end of today's episode. Wow, it went to some really weird places at the end there. Um, but that's just the way it is, I guess. Until next time, everyone. I hope you have a safe day. And have a good day. Goodbye.